Today I'm going to explain common shear unit of electricity. Now there is a question of what is the need of common shear unit of electricity. General energy is measured in joule. Joule is the a smaller unit of electricity or energy. At that place, we have large amount of energy is needed or required. This joule becomes very small. That's why a larger unit is required to calculate the electricity consumed by different electrical appliances. That's why commercial unit is required. Now there is a question which is the commercial unit of electricity or energy. Answer is kilowatt hour. Kilowatt hour is the commercial unit of electricity. It is also known as board of trade unit. It is denoted by KWH, KW for kilowatt and H for hour. This means time for which energy is consumed that should be mentioned in hour. Now there is another question, what is the meaning of 1 kilowatt hour? If it is says that electric energy consumed by plants that is 1 kilowatt, what does it mean? 1 kilowatt hour is that amount of electricity or energy consumed by electrical appliance or appliances of 1 kilowatt hour used for 1 hour. This means <coughs> if there is single electrical appliance having power 1 kilowatt and if it is used for 1 hour, how much energy is consumed? That is 1 kilowatt hour. But the maximum chance to use more than one electrical appliances and total value should be 1 kilowatt. So it is mentioned here either electrical appliance of 1 kilowatt or more than 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 but total value, total power must be 1 kilowatt. If they are used for 1 hour then how much energy is consumed? This is 1 kilowatt hour. So it is rightly said here 1 kilowatt hour equal to 1 kilowatt into 1 hour. This means 1 kilowatt power is used for 1 hour. Formula you know the energy equal to power into time. So power is 1 kilowatt time in 1 hour. So it comes from this formula. Now there is another question. Convert 1 kilowatt hour into joule. So 1 kilowatt hour equal to 1000 watt. As I earlier mentioned, 1 kilowatt means 10 to the power 3 watt. That is 1000 watt. And 1 hour means 60 second. 60 into 60, that is 60 second. 60 second makes 1 minute and 60 minute makes 1 hour. So 60 into 60. This is 36.50 into 1 watt into 1 second. From the definition of 1 watt, we know that 1 watt equal to 1 joule by 1 second. So here, 1 watt into 1 second means 1 joule. 1 joule, 1 watt into 1 second. So in place of 1 watt into 1 second, we can write it 1 joule, when we multiply entire value by 1, we get 3650 joules. This is equal to in scientific form 3.6 into 10 to the power 6 joules. So, how many joules are there in 1 kilowatt? 1 kilowatt hour equal to 3.6 into 10 to the power 6 joules. 1 kilowatt hour is also known as 1 unit. So I have mentioned here 1 kilowatt hour equal to 1 unit. 1 unit equal to 3.6 into 10 to the power 6 joules. So on the basis of electric energy consumed by electrical appliances, we can solve a lot of numerical questions. For your easier purpose, I have written one numerical problem 
based on energy consumption. How much electric energy is consumed by an electric heater of 1.5 kilowatt used for 5 hours? So P equal to 1.5 kilowatt, T equal to 5 hours. So energy consumed by electric heater equal to P into T, 1.5 in kilowatt into 5 hours. This answer is 7.5 kilowatt hours. This means 7.5 units electricity is consumed. So in this way, we can solve a lot of numerical questions. If there are more than one appliance, suppose that in the same question, if there will be two heater of 1.2, yeah, 1.5 kilowatt, so multiply it by 2. So 2 into 1.5 into time, 35 hours, answer will be same. If power is given in what? In such condition, to get the answer in commercial heat, we must convert watt into kilowatt to get the answer in kilowatt hour or unit. So never forget, always remind, if power is given in watt, divide the value by 1000 to get the value in kilowatt, then multiplied by a number of hours to get the answer. In this way, more than two, five, three, six questions can be easily calculated. Thank you, that's all.